Now to the scene of another wedding on Holy Island, high up off the rocky coast of Northumberland. The island is three miles long and nearly two miles broad and is chiefly interesting for the remains of its 900-year-old Benedictine priory. Today the village is all agog, for at the little Norman church there is to be celebrated the first wedding of the war. To be joined together in holy matrimony on Holy Island are 18-year-old Doreen Tuff, a local girl, and Stanley Fred of the Royal Marines whose home is in Sussex. And with the wedding go all the traditional customs. On leaving the church, the bride is given a lucky horseshoe. The giver's lucky too. And here's a close-up picture of Mr. and Mrs. Fred. Then comes the ceremony of the petting stone. Every Holy Island bride ensures her future happiness by mounting the petting stone and jumping down again. Trust the Navy to lend a helping hand. Toll must be paid to the oldest inhabitant for opening the churchyard gates, and then guns are fired to right and left of the wedding party. Money must be thrown to the village children, and what a merry scramble it is. And finally, a plate of cake is broken on the bride's head. But when it's all over, and they lived happily ever after.